guys in this video i'm going to show you how to install fsr4 xss frame generation into battlefield 6. so as you saw in the intro this is only for the free version of the battlefield 6. you know what i mean do not try this on the steam version or any legit copy of the game i'm not responsible if your account get banned this guide is strictly for the free version First, before we install anything, run the game once to change a few settings. When you're in the game, go to Options, Graphics and Advanced. Turn off frame generation. Go back once, scroll down and set the full screen mode to borderless. Turn off vSync. So make sure to do this, if you don't set the full screen mode to borderless, the game will run, you will hear the sound, but you will only see a black screen. So this step is mandatory. Back to the installation part. After that, go to where you installed Battlefield 6. If you have a desktop shortcut, just right click and choose open file location. If you don't, go to the folder manually. Do not extract any files where the red Battlefield 6 EXE is located. If you put anything here, this will not work. Instead, open the SP folder and place the mod files where the black Battlefield 6 EXE is located. You can find the required files in the video description. Open the downloaded file and extract everything into the game file location. and then look for setup underscore windows dot bat file open it press 1 and hit enter then select your gpu for me it's number 2 since i am using nvidia one thing i forgot to mention in the previous videos if you choose amd you will get another prompt asking if you want to use dlss inputs make sure to say yes nvidia users won't see that prompt next open the optiscaler.ini file Set the FG input value to DLSSG and set the output value to XEFG. That's it, now you can launch the game. When you are in game, open the menu again and go to options, graphics and advanced. Set the upscale to DLSS and choose your quality. Enable NVIDIA frame generation. After that, to bring up the OptiScaler menu, press the insert key on your keyboard. You will see that I can't click anything in the menu at first. I don't know if this is an NVIDIA issue or a me problem because I have seen AMD users use it normally. To fix this, press the escape key to pause your game and then you will be able to click the menu. Menu will say restart the game to apply correct XEFG settings. So yes, you must restart. But before restarting, let's make some changes. To enable FSR4, choose FSR3X from the drop down menu and click the change upscaler. And it will automatically enable FSR4. And adjust sharpness if you want and then click save INI button to save the changes. So before enabling frame generation, I'm getting around 55 FPS here. Let's restart the game and see the difference. After restarting the game, go back to the OptiScaler menu to enable frame generation. For that, tick the active box. As you can see, FPS jumps to around 90. If you want the game to feel smoother, you can enable VSync. But remember, it adds a tiny bit of input lag. Since this is a single player game, it's not noticeable at all, for me at least. And then click Save INI button, close the menu, and you are done. No flickering, no weird issues, the game feels smooth. I will play for a bit so you can see whether it crashes or not. And that's it. Until the next video, adios amigos. On it. Clean hit. Lancer. MG is down. Russia! Russia! Push up! Weapons free. Area clear! On me. Let's move.
Let's have you in the fight, Dagger. Radar stations up the hillside. We'll approach through the cave system. Main road's too exposed. Roger. Let's hustle, then. Not even a week, and packs are already heavily entrenched. The ship packs have stirred up. Shipping lanes, trade routes. Takes a lot of nerve to make a play like this. They're sparking old feuds for a reason. Fracturing long-standing alliances. Whoever's put in the bill wants to shake up the world and throw it on its axis. Radar station ahead. Alternating bounding at the gate. Get into position. Don't hang around. We won't wait for you. Copy. Copy. Lancer, we're in position. Roger, what are you seeing? Infantry at the gatehouse, 30 meters. We're on the road further back. Stand by. Gecko, show me why you're on the team. Send it. Rounds down range. Engaging! Lancer, push forward! Roger that, engaging! Clean shot! <laughs> Advancing on the radar station now. Dagger, take position in the tower. Tracking. We got your back. Second position. On me. Copy that. Mills, you copy? Loud and clear, Dagger 1-3. Sit rep. We're on the X. Moving to an overwatch position. You'll know when we start slinging rounds downrange. Good work, Dagger 1-3. Report back once the station's down. Mills out. Onward and upward. Contact! Dagger, we need you! Get out that tower now! Hustle, Gecko! Up the tower! Multiple Dangos ahead! Over! Focus on the high prior targets and the direct threats to Lancer. Copy. We're set in position. Over. Copy that! We're pushing up now! Give us some cover! Weapons free! Clean kill! Gecko, shoot her at the main structure! Don't let him get a beat on us! Infantry, cover by the first Smoke! Smoke! Need to reload! Cover me! Target! Clean! Shoot her down! Vehicle incoming! Lancer, find cover! Gecko! Gun! Move that threat! To the target. Sit rep, Lancer. We're clear. Seeking cover. Stand by. Five, four, three, two, one. Firing now. Secondary objective. Likewise, Lancer. 
Heading to the tunnels now. Good luck. Dagger out. Let's roll. Moving. <laughs> 